early adulthood. This stage defines individuals between the ages of 20 to 35 who are typically vibrant, active and healthy. And they are focused on friendships, romance, childbearing and career. This stage of development includes physical, cognitive, social, personal developments. Yet serious conditions such as violent events, depression, eating disorder, etc. can negatively impact young adults. Before going to the details, please remember to subscribe the channel. Thank you. The physical changes that takes place during the early adulthood stage. Females reach their height by the age of 18. Some males continue to grow till their 20s and most have reached their height by the age of 21. The muscles continue to gain mass, especially among the males. And both the genders continue to add body fat. The average weight gain for both the men and women is about 6 to 7 kilograms. Between the ages of 18 to 35, the individuals experience variety of physical changes. And these changes affect their lifestyle, longevity and health. During this stage of development, they peak in physical strength and by the end of the adulthood, they begin to decline in physical prowess. The senses such as eyesight and smell will be in strongest during the 20s and will start declining its strength once they get closer to 40. The severity of these changes is dependent on the physical strength and health of the individual. For those individuals who exercise and eat healthy, the changes will be less profound and the changes can be seen those who have poor health. There are also hereditary factors that can affect this change in health and physiology. For example, the individuals prone to cancer and other disease, they have increased chances of acquiring this disease. So heredity also plays an important role in physical changes during the early adulthood. The cognitive changes that happens during the early adulthood. The earlier life stages result in dramatic and critical changes. In early adulthood, the essential brain growth already has taken place and the individuals are now applying and using their knowledge and the analytical capabilities. The frontal lobes of the central cortex of the brain. These are the areas where judgment, planning, speaking and moving muscles are located. The brain growth in this area. What happens? It reaches final development during the early 20s. The adults have more flexibility in their thought patterns, understanding that there are multiple opinions on issues and that there is more than one way to approach a problem. So their thinking will be developed. The young adults are able to assimilate and synthesize complex and contradictory situations and arguments, unlike the adolescents. They are focused on developing their career and achieving independence from their families. And it is a crucial requirement for balanced, well-functioning adults. The cognitive development occur as a result of maturation and experience. In this stage, 
the individuals develop logical and abstract thinking the combination of thinking allows them to interpret the world and form changes in belief differently in young adulthood thoughts and beliefs may change as a result of logic combining with experiences such as becoming less idealistic as they were in their earlier days the thoughts become more practical realistic and individualistic with the necessity or prior experience influencing the decision making process so the thinking and related activities will develop and the previous life experience will influence this decision making the thinking become more flexible balanced and allow the people to integrate salient aspects of opposing perspectives so these are the cognitive changes that happen in early adulthood stage emotional changes this stage the early childhood is characterized by relationships the intimacy can be actualized through close friendships romantic relationship or starting a family or all of these three friendship relationship or a family men and women develop the thoughts and feelings of committing to an intimate partner their self esteem become positive why because of being loved and affectionate to others they develop flexible and self regulatory emotional coping strategies and they will develop skills to resolve the conflict the peer influence and the conflict with the parents decline significantly because now they are matured the studies repeatedly find that those who lack the sense of identity they will have less satisfactory relationship and they tend to be more emotionally isolated they will feel lonely and depressed so the lack of strong sense of identity have a negative impact and this depression is a major concern for individuals in their 20s to the mid 30s most of the people diagnosed with the major depression receive a diagnosis in this life stage and this depression is linked to violence especially suicide and eating disorder so care must be taken to have a healthy emotional change in this stage individuals experience social and personality changes early adulthood stage is a time of change with regard to pattern of living during this change new life expectations are formed and the way in which people live radically changes so life expectations are formed and the way in which people live also changes for example marriage career choice and thoughts of having children become more important the idea of stability become important as the individual begin seeking financial stability and relationship stability so they focus on stability in the financial matters and in relationship matters for example most women will conceive and marry between the age of 23 to 29 individuals will also form and consolidate new values the young adulthood is marked by the change in values as many individuals settle down but at the same time become less apt to conform to group pressure and thinking the values of youth may give way to more practical notions of how life should be led this development signifies a growth in maturity and what is thought of as wisdom then people commit 
to social groups and have positive feelings about their membership in the social groups. They integrate spiritual and religious beliefs into their identity. Indeed, social changes in early adulthood facilitate the formation and maintenance of the relationship. Then environmental factors. Changes. We have seen several changes that happens during the early adulthood stage. And these changes are often influenced by environmental factors also. For example, economic factors such as poor job market can influence the experience gained by the individual during this period. The values such as being frugal or being conservative financially can be altered such as during prolonged periods of recession. There are variety of these environmental factors which can affect the development. It includes the status, class, opportunities, politics, etc. It should be noted that young adulthood changes are often affected by the factors that are the result of choices made by the people at earlier stages. So, the decision you made or the choices you made in your earlier stage can affect your development in the adulthood stage. For example, the education choice such as going to college may create different environmental factors later in the early adulthood. So, these are certain environmental factors that can affect the development of individuals. Now let's have a quick recap on what we have learned. We have learned the changes that can happen during the early adulthood and it involves physical change, cognitive change, emotional change and social and personality change and these changes are influenced by certain environmental factors also. This early adulthood is one of the developmental stages that is characterized by person aged between 20 and 35. The social and emotional changes in this phase allow the people to form sustained relationship. Then the physical and cognitive growth are at the peak at this stage. People have increased motor ability and reproductive capacity and their thoughts become more practical and realistic. So this is about the stages of early adulthood. The development process that happens during the early adulthood stage. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe and share. Thank you and keep smiling.